What's going on YouTube? Graves in the here and welcome to the Perfect Roads tutorial. So I want to bring you guys one of these uh, videos because uh, a lot of times in the comments box I get asked how do you make uh, nice and curved roads or perfectly curved roads such as this one right over here all the way down. And um, yeah, here's a uh, video on how to do that. So parallel curved roads perfect curved roads just like so if you're not subscribed yet to the channel and you find the content useful and you learn something hit the subscribe button and if you like the video go ahead and give it a like the more likes we get on the videos the more people lay eyes on them so without further ado let's go ahead and get into the video All right, everybody, so we are gonna begin with perfect 90 degree angles. All right, so let's uh, let's come out here. We're gonna use our two lane roads to start with. So let's go out by uh, four, four blocks, and we're gonna go out by four blocks just like so. So this is now a perfect 90 degree angle. We're gonna make another one over here on this side, but we're gonna go with the higher elevation one up here. So we're gonna go out by four full blocks and over by four full blocks, just like so. So let me minimize this brush so we don't get in trouble. Cool, so now you have an elevated road to the left and a uh, grounded road all the way on the right. So here you're gonna wanna decide how far apart you want these roads, parallel roads to be, right? So on this side, let's say we're gonna go out by uh, half a block. And on this side, let's say we're gonna go out by four, t uh, four tiles, as opposed to a half a block. All right, so let's go over here. We're gonna do the one on the ground first. We're gonna go back out and select our curved tool. And we know we went out by, uh, by a full half a block. Right, so we're gonna go all the way up by four. Right, so we are now at, come on snapping. So we're at four. Now, because we're on the inside lane, right, we're gonna not go out by four full blocks. We're gonna subtract it down to three and a half. And we're gonna go all the way out this way. And we're gonna meet up right here with the road. So here and now you have a perfect 90 degree inside curve, just like so, right? If you were doing an outside curve, instead of going out by three and a half, and you still wanted to have the, um, the half, a, half a block distance in between, you would have gone out by four and a half and went out just like so. And actually, rather than telling you, let's go ahead and show you just in case you don't know what I mean. So we're gonna go out by a full, um, or by half a block. Let's go out and select our curved road. So that is four full blocks right there. We're gonna go out to where we meet half. And just like so, you have a perfect outside lane as well. Same exact thing applies and if you're going in the other direction or if you're going in a different elevation as well. So here we're gonna go out by four. We're gonna come out this way by four. And then over here, let's go out. We said we were gonna go four tiles. So just like so. So out this way, instead of going all the way out by four, come on, there we go we're gonna subtract four tiles, right? So one, two, three, and four. And we're gonna go out here, meet with that node right there. And there you go, you have a perfect 90 degree angle every single time. So all you're using here is a little bit of addition and subtraction. Next, we're gonna move into our free form roads, which Believe it or not, before road guidelines, this was near impossible to uh, to make, right? Um, but now, now it's a lot easier. 
So you can make a freeform road that goes as far out as that and that curves as, as much as you would like it to curve. The only thing you gotta decide is how far apart you want them to be. So we're gonna make this one. Hey, little buddy. We're gonna make this one a, um, I don't know, two, two tiles again, this distance. So first thing you're gonna do is again, decide your distance and select where, where your starting point is and go out to the first node again, you are gonna be in the freeform tool for this. Go out to the first node, meet with it, and then just simply meet the next node. So you see right here how our solid blue line is perfect, or pretty much perfectly parallel um, or covering the, uh, the dotted line. That's where you're gonna look for, right? And you're gonna repeat that for every single node going all the way around until you finish. your perfectly parallel freeform road. Now, a lot of times if you if you if you get into an issue where it's not snapping perfect, just be patient, work with it. Right? Zoom in, zoom out a little bit, try to get that perfect angle that you need to have and it was there. I promise it was. There it is. So you'll have to finagle with it just a little bit, but uh, with a little bit of extra effort, it's it's there. You just need to to be patient, right? So let's see if, oh, there it is, there, there, there. there it is, perfect, all right. And then continue on. But you guys, um, you guys get the idea. Right, it's it's 100% doable to have it line up perfectly. Oh, I almost had it. There we go. I'm gonna finish it, I promise. By the way, if you guys are not subscribed and you found you are finding this tutorial helpful, please uh, hit the subscribe button. Also, if you like the video, hit like. The more uh, the more likes any video gets, the more uh, the more exposure it gets, and uh, the more people get a chance to see it because it tells YouTube that it is a highly liked video. So that'll help some of those folks out um, that are searching for a, for a tutorial video that haven't been able to found, find one yet. Find this one and help them make perfectly parallel roads in their city. And there you have it. Perfect parallel roads from start to finish. Now, a couple of uh, couple of questions I've been asked during my Let's Play series. By the way, if you want to check those out, either click on the I button in the top right or wait until the end of the video for the thumbnails. But a um, couple, uh, couple of questions I've been asked is how to get the three-lane highway to, uh, to be super close together. So let's go out by 12 units here. And we're going to go out by 340 here. And we're just going to get rid of this guy. So 340 is the cost um, there. Or if you want to count the tiles, here we are at um, at five. It is three, three tiles out in uh, in distance. And then all you do is you upgrade And voila, you have a super close together highway. And then it works 
add the same if you were curving it too. Let's go out to our two lane roads. So I like to use two, two lane roads because they're the easiest to handle in my opinion. And again, so when you're making this perfect curve, we know the distance in between is three. So we're gonna go out by three and it actually marked it for us right away. And we're gonna select that, then go over here and upgrade. There we go. And yet another perfect curve. Um, I'm not going to bother going over how to slope with you guys because that is very self-explanatory, right? So something uh, something like that. Um, perfect circles. Again, you guys should know how to do this with the help of the, um, the road guidelines that we currently have. But perfect circle is easily achievable. I do it as I said that I wasn't going to do it, right? Um, and you can follow this method if you are, um, even if you're using, say, for example, the uh, the train tracks or metro tracks, monorail tracks, how, well, whatever you want to follow your road, just simply decide what distance you want to be and follow the... Um, Follow the nodes, you know, so there you go. Yet another perfect curve. All right, everybody. So that is going to wrap it up for in this tutorial. If you found it useful and helpful, go ahead and hit the like button as well as subscribe for more tutorials and let's play series. As I mentioned previously, in the tutorial. I do have Let's Play series going on. We actually just finished with season three and uh, season four is in the works and coming out uh, shortly, soon. Um, but yeah, if you like the video, go ahead and, uh, go ahead and uh, hit like and subscribe for more. As always, be the best that you can be in everything that you do. And I will see you guys on the next one.